Hello everyone, and welcome back to another episode of this How to Stormavik 1946 Iron Man series. As you may see, we are at the Marianas now, and that is because after uh, the community poll I put up uh, had a couple days to, to brew and whatnot, it ended up being a draw, and as a result I decided to take matters into my own hands and make the decision. And well, I decided to continue the series because it seemed uh, like a little bit of a pitiful end to make a loving story here if uh, we considered him captured at Tarawa after bailing out only like a mile past the arbitrary front lines. So we're just going to say that for all intents and purposes he was picked up by friendly forces in the, the following days after his bailout and uh, after being subject to such harsh conditions was given, you know, some time off and whatnot, but now he's back in June of 1944 for the Marianas operation, which ended up resulting in the largest carrier battle in human history, the Battle of the Philippine Sea, which I'm not sure how well it's going to be represented in this dynamic campaign. If I don't think it's being represented fairly, I may throw in a mission or two from a static campaign I know about that would do it more justice. But based off of the briefing here, it looks like whoever designed this dynamic campaign might actually include that in it. But without further ado, let's get into the mission. So, the briefing. The Mariana Islands are our next destination. Operation Forager's goal is the complete invasion of the three main islands of the archipelago, providing us a forward base for both our naval forces and our strategic bomber units. B-29s, baby. Like in the previous offenses, offensives of the same kind, you are to heavily sweep the enemy air bases of the area, and then provide close air support to our landing forces. But remember, we are not assaulting atolls anymore. Our targets here are real islands, okay? Thank you for telling me that. With real fortifications and real defenses. Okay, I guess uh, atolls didn't have real defenses, apparently. We are also hoping for the mobile fleet to make an attempt to battle us around the objective. Okay, so that's the Battle of the Philippine Sea that ends up happening, I was talking about. Be prepared for heavy cap carrier air patrol and search activities as long as we will have not found the enemy main body. Okay, interesting phrasing. If there is to be an encounter, it must be a decisive one. The Marianas shall be a doom to the mobile fleet. Which, historically, it did end up destroying what little was left of the Japanese carrier force. So, Squadron CO is Lieutenant Commander Judy. Yeah, so as a result, I had to kind of start a new campaign, per se. Um, but uh, through some crafty editing and whatnot, I was able to port over the statistics that I had before into this new campaign, so to speak. But, however, all the squadron people from before are gone. We'll just say they, you know, did their 30 sorties, rotated out, and are training future pilots in California or something. But, uh, yeah, we'll get to know the new people in our squadron. We've got a couple aces already here when, with uh, Lieutenant Junior Grade Irwin and Lieutenant Kotinsky. But, uh, yeah, a little less weird names this time. There's no weirdish, you know, something like that. I got a plumber, though. And, uh, Ny Ny Nyhagen? Nyhagen? I don't know how to pronounce that one. But, uh, interesting. Okay. So, what are we doing here? It's June 14th, 1944. 9... 09... 15 hours. 9 in the morning. Okay. Weather's pretty good. Clouds are low. Alright, so, command a group of 6F6F3s, task is to escort some Avengers, TBF1s, to sector BE33. So, right over Guam here. I will be leading a second flight of F6F3s with aviation pilot first class Pritchard on my wing. Now, we have bombs and stuff again, which, as someone pointed out in a previous episode's comment, is actually a bug in the game 
that's going to be giving us uh, loadouts even when we don't need them. But considering this is a ground attack mission for the Avengers, uh, I mean, it kind of makes sense that we'd have it. I can technically change it for my flight, but I think I'm going to keep it on because there are likely going to be ground targets there, and if there's no uh, enemy air opposition, which I kind of hope there is because I want to actually do some, some dogfighting in this campaign. The only actual dogfight we kind of had was in the very first mission where we shot down a zero over Wake Island. Since then, it's really just been ground and pound, so I'm kind of hoping there's some opposition this time. But, without further ado, let's get into it. It also looked like we had a pretty long flight ahead of us, which obviously I'm not going to subject you guys to. Use this crafty thing called editing to spare you the monotony. Alright. Yeah, same old, same old. Standard takeoff procedures. But yeah, I'll catch up with you guys once we're in the air. Alright, welcome back. We're all in formation and everything. Now, I was actually having a bit of an issue with the AI here. I think the mission has our flights flying a little too close. Because uh, right now I don't have the autopilot on. Um... But when I have the autopilot on, my guy just starts, like, almost crashing into number four on the first wing, and I'm like, I don't want to die because the, the autopilot's being a little funky and someone didn't get their flight lines right when making this campaign. But, uh, but yeah, so I think I'm just going to sit up here with the level stabilizer and just adjust with rudder trim to stay on course. But yeah, also looking at the uh, the flight length, yeah, we've got a, a long ways to go. So, uh, yeah, it's gonna be a while. Like, uh, how long? It was almost 300 kilometers? Yeah, so, uh, Hopefully we have enough fuel for this. In fact, I think I'm actually going to uh, drop my payload here. Because uh, fuel conservation might actually be a problem on this mission. But yeah. I will see you guys when we're closer to Guam. Alright, it looks like we got sight of Guam here. So far, things have been pretty quiet. I've used up a good portion of fuel, about a quarter of the tank here. Yeah, 76% fuel remaining. So I think we'll have enough. As long as there isn't any extended combat, we should be fine. But yeah, I'll see you in a bit. Alright, it's looking like we got company. Oh, we got company, yep. We certainly have company. Copy, I got you covered. We gotta speed things up. Oh jeez, there's a lot of them actually. Why are they all coming for me? Please? No. Bro. Attention, fighters, eleven o'clock. I'm just running, bruh. Screw this, bruh. Two, four, zero, one, no, five. run, bro. Run. I can't save you from four fighters, bro. Get out. Oh, damn, he's dead. Oh, whoa. Yeah, screw that, bro. I'm... What the hell? Stay with your leader. What are you Zero, talking six, about, Zero, one, five. Over. I gotta run, bruh. 
I ain't messing with six zeros, right? Well, jeez, there goes Pictish or something. I think his name was. Yeah, I... Attention. Oh, hold on. Okay, this I can mess with. I... They're on to me. Oh, jeez. Oh, this is some escort. Let's just keep running. There's too many, man. We don't have a clear advantage. Dead ahead. There's more. They shouldn't be catching up with me. They're not catching up. All right, broskies. What's going on here? They're not catching up, but uh, I also don't want to be. That's not. Where are you guys? Dude, where are you people? Are you, you're under the need the clouds, aren't you? Okay, I'm not a fan, not a fan, not a fan. Get the hell away from these people. Jeez, are they right behind? I got him. He's on fire. Crap. I really don't like this. Like, I'm hung out to dry here. All right, we gotta take action. Bombs away. Attacking with rockets. This ought to cause some problems. Target on fire. Direct hit. There we go. Yes. Level out, level out. Alright, let's just get away. How? How on earth did a zero keep up with me? What? Dude. What? Well, this is not looking good. I have no idea how Zira could keep up with me in that. What the? Let's go back to my friends. Like, I'm going... I'm booking it, man. What do you think I'm trying to do? I don't like how I can't... Yeah. Don't pull up. Jeez. If they stay on me through this, I'm going to be a little annoyed. Get him off me. Alright. You wanna play, son? Maybe like that. Want to go, son? Good kill. 
Oh, okay, okay. Did I pilot snipe somebody? Jeez. Uh huh. You want to do that? You want to go, bro? Yeah, I didn't think you wanted to do that. Oh, crap. Okay, friends? Friends, please. I can't deal with this many zeros at once. Yes, please, please actually do something to help me. Because this is not it. I know there's that guy behind me, but I, this guy's hanging himself out to dry. I don't want to get too slow, though. How on earth is he still going that fast? Can't see him. Can't see the guy. Where the heck? Okay. No, thank you. Whoa. No. No, thank you. No, 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 no. Where is he? Where is he? Where is he? Can't see him. Oh, jeez. Yes, yes, yes. Engage him. Engage him. Nope, nope. I don't want to play this game. I need more help than this. Where is... Oh, oh my gosh. What? Ah, crap. Is there somebody behind me? Yep. We gotta... Oh my gosh, there's three of them on me. No, my gosh. Yo, can you people help? This isn't... This isn't, uh, very nice. What the hell? Stay with oh, you're gonna... Okay. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. If my wing goes off, I'm dead. Bro. I'm kinda pissed right now. My friends are not helping me at all. Like, this is kinda ridiculous. Jeez. Come on. I... Overshooting. Oh boy. Where's the other one? Get off me. Let's go, let's go. Come on. You want a tango? Oh gosh. Run. We'll take care of him. I see red over there. Oh, are you serious? It's the third one is coming. Yeah, you're not going to do it. Please, break off. Get away. Okay. Ah, the third one's coming back. I see my friends don't believe in actually... Helping. Like, where where are you people, bro? You're just hanging me out to dry, and just, I mean, to be fair, I, I located that. Oh my gosh, yo, somebody help my. Like, what am I supposed to do here? Oh, crap! That was bad. Oh gosh, that's bad. Come on. I can't do much more maneuvering. Oh boy. Oh boy. Yes, yes. Actually, dogfight these people, bro. Come on. Where is this guy? Hello? Where are you people going? Roger, here we go. 
This guy's just gonna keep... you know what? Yeah. Oh, and now the other bookmates are back. Praise God I'm in a Hellcat. Or else I would have been dead by now, probably. Uh-huh, uh-huh. Ah, oh, I missed. There's another one. Yep. Slow down, slow down, slow down. Not like that, though. Not like that. Come on. Oh, my gosh. Yo, shoot these people down, cuh. What are y'all doing, bro? Y'all sleeping, bro. Oh no. No 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 no. Overshoot, overshoot, overshoot. Mm -hmm. Like you people have the advantage in everything. Roger, attacking bandit. This isn't working. Oh no. I need to get out of here. Where's the closest? Oh my gosh, I gotta go across the freaking island. I've got no rudder controls. What are you talking about? I'm dying over here. You people are the worst excuse for uh, pilots I've ever seen. Oh my gosh. I've just got to get out of here. And I'm not faster than them at this altitude, apparently. So... I'm really just screwed right now. Oh my gosh. I wasn't even at a hundred percent prop pitch. Are you serious? I see you. Honestly, I don't need to be at a hundred percent right now. I'm just trying to get away. What is he doing? He's trying to pull a top gun on me. Fly right over my canopy upside down. Like what the heck? Alright, I've got to make it past here, and I'm just going to bail out. Or... Where'd he go? Where'd he go? No, oh, he's... Oh, boy. Wait, oh, you want to get in front of me? Oh my gosh, I forgot. No rudders, no rudders, no rudders. Oh my gosh. Yeah, how low can you go? Oh my gosh. Hopefully the AI don't like flying on the deck like this. Because I am screwed. They're coming back for more then. Ah. Visibility is not good. I cannot see them. I need to be able to see. Okay. Are any of them close to me right now? Oh, yep. Uh-huh. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm, No, they're coming back. Are you serious? Oh, I hear you. Oh, what? You overshot me, bro? 
You sure you want to fly right there, bro? Oh, I couldn't get it. Almost halfway there. Come on. Alright. Where's the second one? I see him. Okay. Oh, crap. This is pain. This is pain. Oh, here we go. Here we go. No, 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 no. Yeah, that's right. I'm too slow. Take that. Where's the other one? See him. Oh, I'm not scissoring right now, bro. <laughs> He's not using cannons. That's a good sign. Perhaps he ran out? Bro, I'm not playing this game. Because I literally cannot play this game. Right now. Okay, that must be the flight leader, because the second one... It's not really trying to shoot at me. I don't like that guy just sitting up there. He could dive on me any moment. Oh boy, here we go again. Nope, 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 nope. Oh. <laughs> oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Okay. Oh boy. <laughs> okay. I almost crashed. While I'm looking at these guys. Gotta be almost there. Oh my gosh. What are you doing? Oh. Okay, that gave me some height. Oh. Are they breaking off? No, they're gonna come back right there. Are you serious, man? Okay, let's start going a little more to the right. I have no rudder, that's right. Okay. Okay, okay, okay. Almost there. Uh, where are they? Oh, they're directly behind me. Lovely. I love that. I'm in friendly territory. Okay. Oh, I can't see. Oh, where the heck are they? I just need to know where they are. Oh my gosh. Come on. Get off my case, bro. Hop off! I... Whoa. Okay, they broke off. Where's the other guy? Dude, where is the other guy? Okay, he's not actively going for me. Okay. This is scary, this is scary, this is scary. Oh my gosh. Slower, slower, slower. Slower. A little slower, I want it under a 200. Oh my gosh. Okay, okay. Bail out, bail out, get out, get out, get out, get out. Oh my goodness. Whew. Okay. Oh my gosh. 
that scared me, man. I thought I was I thought I was a goner. Nope. We made it. Oh my gosh. Nice. Okay. Alright. You fools, where are you? Here's one. There's two. What? They're just still over the island? What the heck? They're all separated. What the heck? Yeah, these people are bozos. They did not help me at all. They, lo they left me to die. Which is... Not it, man. Not it. These guys... I think uh, these are the A6M5s, I believe. Yeah, there were a lot of them. But, uh... What is he doing? I don't know what one is doing right now. Zero, six, zero, one, five. I don't want to end it while he's over enemy territory, because then it might consider him missing. Oh my gosh, I can't believe we survived that. Dude, I thought it was a goner when there were four zeros on me, man. Jeez. Yes, please get out. Alright, well, I'll see you guys when I'm back at the briefing. Oi. Alright, let's take a look at what happened. So yeah, flew the 300 kilometers to Guam. Then, right around like here, it's uh, enemy fighters. 15 to 20 Zeeks, bro. That's, uh, that's not good. But yeah, I, I couldn't really help Pritchard out because he ran away from me and had four zeros on him. And we were not, we were at a disadvantage as well, which is just all sorts of bad, so I, I had to run away. They blew up some stuff. Then I somehow shot down a zero. I'm pretty sure it must have been a pilot snipe on a deflection or something like that. I, because I didn't see any, I didn't mess up any aircraft visibly enough from shooting them. I just saw a plane crash into the ground and I got credits. So I'm going to assume that it was a pilot snipe or control snipe or something like that. And then I spent the remaining part of the flight literally fighting for my life, hanging on by a thread, trying to get over friendly territory, and then when I finally did, I ditched. And survived. I survived. So, uh, looks like uh, we only got two kills as a, as a squadron here. Lieutenant Junior Grade Irwin got a kill, and then our boy McLovin got a kill. But uh, other than that, Pretty... that's pretty much it. Whew. What a first day over Guam. Jeez, man. It's elevating my heart rate. But without further ado, let's, uh, let's apply this. See what's up for the next mission. Okay. Hey, I got the Navy and Marine Corps medal. And that actually makes me an official ace. That's, that was my fifth kill, technically. Looks like uh, we decided to get a lot closer. Alright, this is also going to be on June 14th. Realistically, though, I would not be flying right now because I ditched, but, you know, can only do so much.
Okay, so it's gonna look like it looks like another escort mission. Looks like we don't have to fly as far, thankfully. But yeah, whew, what a mission. Thanks for joining me. And uh see you guys in the next one.